on the subscribe button and press on the bell icon to watch my all new videos hey what's up guys this is jal kumar sen and today in this tutorial i'll share with you some important points of venturi meter right which is really helpful for you for competitive examination that's why i have arranged to arrange all these points to share with you right so first of all let me share with you what is the uh, function main function of this device that is what rate of flow for measuring rate of flow that is what discharge and it is denoted by what q right later on i will share with you formulas related to it right second point i would like to share with you the value the value of coefficient of discharge cd okay that is lying in between 0.96 to 0.98 which is really high as compared to other uh, rate of flow measuring devices third point i would like to share with you that is length of this device is long right fourth point i would like to share with you the angle of convergence angle of convergence is about 20 plus minus 1 that means it could be 20 or it could be 90 or in between right fifth point which is also important angle of divergence angle of divergence of venturi meter is lying in between 5 to 15 degree right next point i'd like to share with you so till now how many points we have discussed till now we have discussed i hope we have discussed around five points let's go for six point six point is here the cost of this device is high cost is high right high cost so maybe because of that we prefer other devices for uh, for measuring rate of flow in many cases where cost is matter a lot another point is accuracy accuracy is quite good fantastic accuracy you can say that fantastic accuracy right accuracy is just fantastic right eighth point that is what uh, head loss head loss is less yes head loss is less and ninth number point i'd like to share with you it is based on the principle of bernoulli's equation i hope you have watched the tutorial uh, assumption of bernoulli's equation there i have shared a lot of things regarding this now most important thing the formula right formula we will use to solve numerical problem in case of venturi meter is here coefficient of discharge is equal to actual discharge discharge upon theoretical discharge theoretical discharge okay now let's say this is qac and this is qth so cd into qth is equal to qac therefore qac now we will put the value of qth that is what a1 a2 root under a1 square plus a2 square into root under 2gh so this is the formula which is really useful in case of venturi meter and uh, hope you got some new information related to venturi meter and thanks guys thanks for watching see you soon in my next video tutorial bye bye